Hey guys, welcome to Loughborough University, where in a few short weeks, Loughborough Cycling Festival will be taking place. Join me as I go around the course for a quick course preview, highlighting some of the uh, important areas on the course and uh, showing you guys what to look out for. There are still places available, so be sure to enter and I hope to see you there. Okay, here we go. So crossing over the start and finish line. First tarmac speed bump leading into the first left-hand corner on the course. Again, by this time, most of the riders will be up to speed, but we'll immediately have to curb the speed going into the hill as they cross over the second and third tarmac speed humps. Straight into the short, sharp, punchy climb where most of the main attacks will be happening on the course. If you're a spectator, this is the place to be. Up past the uh, National Cricket Centre of Performance, past James France on the left-hand side. Final speed hump for the hill. The lap to cast will be burning at this point for most of the riders. And again, if you've got anything left to give, here is the place to give it. As from here on in, the course is mostly downhill or flat. Over this short flat section, flat section here, expect to see group splinter and riders go off the front as those who are more technically minded attack into the descent. Sharp left-hander here, followed pretty soon by right-hand bend going past the geography block. Extra caution needed on that bend there. There will be uh, hay bales in place. All these speed bumps that can be removed will be removed on the day. Now the fun begins. Onto the descent. <clears throat> Into a sweeping left hand bend. Immediately followed by a right hand bend. Again, both of those corners, probably two of the fastest on the course. Downhill continues, down towards power base and the National Centre for Sport and Exercise Medicine. Going into the penultimate bend now. Again, expect this to be a super fast one if we go past the rugby pitches. Sweeping past power base and up towards the final corner. Expect to see plenty of power being laid down here, lap after lap, as riders try to break each other. And of course, on the final lap, where position going into this corner will be absolutely crucial for the win. Final few meters now. And as you cross the finish line, you'll be able to see the event village on the right-hand side. And uh, yeah, excited to see who takes victory on the day.